Eutectic gallium indium is a metal alloy that is liquid at room temperature. It is both highly conductive and super stretchable. It has applications in soft and stretchable devices, as well as batteries, catalysts, and capacitors. A major limitation of a gain is that it has incredibly high surface tension, making it challenging to pattern or make into high surface area microstructures. A technique called laser centering can overcome this issue. A laser hits the gain particles, centering them. This method can be used for rapid, high resolution patterning of a gain. However, Improvements could be made to laser centering. First, is it possible to remove the particles that are not hit by the laser and therefore are not conductive? Second, can we transfer the conductive pattern to a soft substrate? Lastly, is it possible to increase the surface area of the conductive film? We added a polymer, polyamic acid, to the laser centering process. First, a solution containing PAA and again particles was spray coated onto a substrate. Second, a laser was used to make conductive patterns. The result is a liquid metal carbon composite. First, we were able to remove the particles not exposed to the laser. A polymer layer was added underneath the again PAA film. When placed in water, the polymer underneath dissolves releasing the non-conductive regions. After 10 minutes, the non-conductive regions can easily be peeled off. Meanwhile, the conductive regions stay strongly adhered to the glass. Second, we transferred the again carbon film to a soft substrate and demonstrated its stretchability. This LED is connected to the same circuit as this again carbon film coated in elastomer. Despite stretching the film, the brightness of the LED doesn't change. The again carbon foam hardly changes resistance when stretched, only reaching around 1.02 times its original resistance at 100% strain. It also has very high surface area, 2,632% higher than bulk again. The fabricated again carbon composite has potential applications in soft circuits, capacitors, batteries, and catalysts. To read more about the work, please visit this link.